Hey guys, it's John Gidding. Welcome to my backyard in San Francisco. I'm gonna give my backyard a makeover and give you some tips on how to maximize any outdoor space. The first thing to do when designing your backyard is to really think about how you're gonna use the space. For me, I want a lounging space and a dining space. And this yard has some pretty clear zones for me. This is the sunniest spot right here versus the other side of the yard, which is pretty shady because of that tall bamboo thicket. Dining in the shade makes a lot of sense. You don't want to eat under the beating sun. And it's also great because it's close to the kitchen. Okay, it's time to bring in some furniture. Rugs define indoor spaces and they do the same thing for the outdoors. The key to picking a great outdoor rug is to make it look like an indoor rug as much as possible. This has a woven look, which really elevates the space. And it's highly durable, entirely weatherproof, and it's gonna look great for a long time to come. I love this as a side table because it's got a lot of square footage and I can create a casual dining experience for my lounge area. But whenever need one, I can also bring it in front of the lounge area for additional dining seating if needed. When it comes to color and pattern, you're going to want a feature color that's gonna be your base. That's the red of these cushions. When I wanna play off of this red, there's a couple different ways of doing it. I can either choose tones of red, which I'm doing with the various accessories, or I can play off of this color using patterns. I pick stripes because stripes always mix and match easily with one another, and I'm a big fan of the pinstripe suit. Acrylic glasses, great for the outdoors. When it comes to seating, I love sectionals because they're so versatile. You should always look for flexibility when it comes to your design needs because you can switch up the seating depending on your needs. My lounge space is complete. I love this dining set. It seats six, which is how many people we've got living in this house, so that's perfect. As the sun casts over in that direction, this bamboo thicket is gonna give me a nice block of shade and it's very comfortable. All right, now we start to decorate. Bright, crisp runner that gives me a central strip to work off of. This is where all the dining implements and accessories are gonna be. Plenty of space at this table for eating. I got all this stuff from homedepot.com. It's great because their online store has everything you need to enjoy outdoor living. From string lights to patio sets to outdoor fabrics. Plus, so many designs and colors to pick from without skimping on quality construction, which is super important for outdoor furniture. Finally, they've got the custom patio furniture program, so when it comes to cushions, you can pretty much pick any color you want. My table is set up. It's informal, it's cute, it's got nice bright colors, perfect for a summer day. I've got different metallics. This looks a little bit brassy. This is rose gold. This is regular gold. The great thing about metallics is they play off of one another. It's almost like patterns. You can mix and match, do shades on shades, and it all looks great. I'm also embracing nature here. There's leaf motifs. There's natural acacia serving bowls. It just feels like part of the outdoor nature scape. 